Hi everyone, it's the Psychic Sleuth, and um, so I just wanted to do a quick video real quick. I'm sorry I didn't get on my live tonight, but I had escape goats that I had to take care of, and I just got to it too late. So anyways, I wanted to talk to you guys about May Maya and some things that I discovered, and I want to see what you guys think, because it's weird kind of how all this happened. I was sitting here, and I was watching... Um, a missing persons thing where these people went missing in oh what's it called um, Idlewild California which is by Hemet for some reason I wanted to look at Hemet and see exactly where it was because someone had mentioned it to me well so I go and I look and I was kind of astonished by what I found. So today I was going over Linda's reading, as you guys know, um, trying to find the validations and everything because she was found. And as you know, that there's interconnect. So I'm thinking that there is an interconnect with Linda. There's an interconnect with Suzanne and, and Gannon in all of these. And I'm not really sure why Gannon, unless it's the water. And there's a couple names that I feel like inter could interconnect with Gannon. But not only that, I think that the reason why Suzanne fits is because um, of who's involved. And then I feel like um, Linda because of the timing of things. So in Linda's reading, I don't know if you guys remember, but if you go back, I believe it was the... I can't remember if it was the second or third reading. I got Diamond, okay? Um, so... I did, it doesn't really fit Linda's, right? Um, at all. So, I always take what doesn't fit, since we now see what kind of fits her reading, we can take what doesn't fit and see if it's going to interconnect somewhere else. But it just clicked today, because... Because... It was just weird how I found that show, and it sent me to, like I said, to him, and, and which sent me to this Diamond Lake, which the only thing is, is that there's not any, I don't see any docks, however, there could be docks on the lakes, you know, around it, because there's a few other ones, um, so there's a, there's some other validations here that I have that I want to share with you guys, so... I know she said the K name. Now that can be the tribe that's out there. I can't pronounce it. Um, I, I don't even want to try to pronounce it. So I, I don't. I'm sorry if I butcher it. But the Kumaye. Um, so that could be the K name. This is Kumaye territory. However, it's just different bands, so they're known as different um, things. You know, different names. So, um, let me see. Let me scroll back up here and tell you. There are national forests nearby. When I was looking at this, I kind of was like, oh, wow, that reminds me of Linda because there's tall grass, there's yellow flowers, there's wild flowers that I, I think I got in Linda and some other readings. And it reminds me of that, like in my vision, when I saw the tall grass, the wild flowers, and there's a lot of yellow flowers. There's actually a picture of a lady standing in a field of all yellow flowers in this area. There is a dam. There's actually an east dam, what I, which I thought was interesting, and three dams, which I got the number three. Um, there is dinosaurs, which came in Gannon, um, a lot in Gannon. So there's like a little dinosaur area out there. Um, Let me see. So, the biggest thing that is kind of making me wonder is I got a really bad headache and I got extremely exhausted and my chest got tight in this area. Now, I've been to multiple areas all over this map and that's never happened. Not in the area that I posted, I thought, before because of the name and it matched and everything. Remember, the way that I work is I try to got to match up everything and there's a lot of places that can match what I'm getting. This kind of makes more sense to me because more is fitting. 
um, there is a windy road that leads to the lake or to the reservoir, whatever. Um, it's called a lake. Um, there is also in Linda, I got a tea. It does not fit Linda that I can find, but this is by Temecula. Um, there is also um, Rainbow came in Suzanne. Hot Springs came in Suzanne. That's all in this area. Like I said, it would be an interconnect. Um, I think Rainbow came in Gannon as well, and we know that Gannon's interconnecting. Um, there's a Green Acres right there. Green came in Linda multiple times. Um, there is this this road. Uh, what's it called? Um, shoot, where'd it go? I can't even pronounce it. it. Starts with a D. It's right by there. That name is another name for that tribe. Um, there's the name, the road Simpson. Okay, now get this. This is where the interconnect is kind of weird. So, in S Simpson, I got, um, like, right before, uh, Gannon was found, and it was on my randoms list, or something. I can't remember if it was on the randoms list or in the reading. But, he was found by a Simpson Road. Now, Simpson Road, there is a Simpson Road right here by this area as well. Also, all three of the freeways that I got, the 8, the 15, to the and the 10, all are around this area. They're all the main freeways right there. Um, so, I find it interesting. I don't know if there's camping. There probably is because, I mean, it looks like that kind of area around there somewhere. Because, like I said, there's National Forest. And I said it could be around a National Forest. So that makes sense, but the fact that this name came in Linda, Linda was found, this is the timing of Linda being found, and this, and, and Maymaya being law, you know, being missing, um, that, that is why the interconnect. So when I saw that high grass and yellow flowers, it was kind of like, wow, and the lake kind of was like how I saw my vision, because I saw a bigger size lake. Now this is a deeper lake, it would make more sense, I just... I don't see any docks. Now, I don't know, like I said, if it goes for another, um, it could, there's other reservoirs in the area. I, I'm not really sure. Um, that's kind of the only thing that's missing that I can see from the map. Now, there might be one that I'm not aware of. Um, but, he would know the area. It's a straight shot from the house. Um, I'm starting to think that Big Bear was why I kept getting Bear and Suzanne. Um, but this area is the only area that's made me sick. So that's why I wanted to come on here and share it with you. Because, I mean, I don't know the air, that area. I'm tempted to even drive down there. Um, because I actually have a friend from that area. I just kind of tempted to drive down and see what I feel. But it's about two hours away from me. Two hours and thirty minutes. It's quite a drive. Um... But I'm, I'm very tempted if I can get my friend to maybe meet me, but she's kind of far away too. So I don't know because I don't want to go by myself because this actually is an area kind of by where all these people are missing on that show that I was watching. So um, it's late. It's 1235. And so that's why I look like crap right now, but... I, I don't know, I just had to kind of get on here and make a video because it was tripping me out because there was stuff in Linda that is there, there's stuff in Gannon that was there, and there's stuff in Suzanne that's there, and it's kind of all fitting together like a little puzzle piece, and the fact that I feel sick there, and my pendulum is indicating yes there. Um, so I don't know if he actually knew that area. Um, he probably did. I think, I think that's all I could find as of now that validates, but it's a lot that validates. Um, and as we know, as, as I'm, I'm starting, I learned a lot from Linda's case today, uh, about prior readings and how things come in prior, but they're very, very important. And so the fact that I was going through Linda's validation today, something made me do that and get that up. And then I saw this stuff, and I was went over her reading a few times, and now I saw this stuff, and then I was led to this lake tonight. I don't think that's a coincidence. Um, spirit leads us in all kinds of ways, whether it be a sign, a feeling, whatever. And I feel like I was led there for 
a reason that a lot of this stuff is fitting. So let me know what you guys think. Let me know if that's possible. Um, I can't get over the diamond thing because diamond is coming for a very, very long time. That's why I think it's important. I believe it came in Susan as well. And that was also the same type of person that caused the missing person, you know, their wife to go missing. And again, everyone is innocent until proven guilty, but Diamond's been coming in for quite a while. And it seems to be coming in in all the ones that have a wife, husband thing there. So, um, it's probably very, very important and I've been looking for it for a long time. And here it is. Anyways, I just wanted to get that off my chest. I could not sleep or do anything else until I made a video, put it out there, see what you guys thought. Um, I will talk to you guys soon. Let me know.